We are at the Maritime Academy in Gdynia, so we are in Poland. My name is Karol Parafian and I am psychologist for seafarers. We are in the Department of Navigation. We have a lot of students, of course boys and girls. And nowadays we can see a growing interest to become a seafarer. Money is the first reason why they want to become a seafarer. We know that the seamen, we know that the seafarers can earn relatively more money than their friends on land. Seafarers have no problem to get a job. In a situation where it's difficult to find a good job, this reason can be very important. Of course, not only money is important. We know that they can see all the world. They can see beautiful places. They can know interesting people, they can know different cultures. Next reason is they have a lot of free time. It's balanced. For example, if you stay two, three months on board, it gives you about two months at home. You can do what you want, you can spend your money, you can enjoy this situation. Of course, in Poland we can say uh, this money can be very good. Not like, uh, for example, in England or in Germany, but money really is the first reason. There are many reasons to study in the maritime school. I'm thinking about the Gdynia Maritime University. First of all, there is a lot of job for the graduates. Uh, the job is uh, uh, very profitable. It means that the salary is, is uh, very often extremely high. Uh, then the, the graduates, they are um, growing with the, with the technique, with the, all the computers, which with the all upgrading because the, the vessels the, the, there is a place where we are working with the with the newest technical equipment. Mamy gdzie czy pies w którym kierunku nas niesie. Bo teraz tak, on idzie, czy rufa nam się zbliża, ale bo teraz swoje też robi. We have also other possibility. We can also study in the Maritime College. We have the Maritime College, which giving also with the, with the short time, relatively short time, giving the possibility to get the officer license. At the moment, we have many students who like to, to join our university and our, our college. We have also students from the other countries. Why from other countries also? Because uh, there's the same market uh, on uh, which we are working as a, as a Polish uh, seafarers. A lot of students from other countries coming because it's officially known that in the near future will be of the officers on, the, on board of the, of the vessels. But also if we see the equipment on which we are teaching our students, they are also very modern simulators, very modern computers. The same like in the uh, like the pilots on the uh, on the aeroplanes are uh, on train. Hello, my name is Hassan. I'm from Kenya and currently studying at the Gdynia Maritime College. I chose to be a seafarer for the for first is because it runs in the family. My grandfather is a seaman, my father is a captain, so I'm just following the footsteps. And for secondly, I chose to be a seaman because it actually pays very good nowadays and uh, you get very good contracts, you usually spend four months at sea, four months at home and you get to visit almost the whole world. So I advise, choose to be a seaman. Hello, my name is Kamen Kamenov and I'm coming from Bulgaria. I choose to be a seafarer because of the good money which I can earn. Also, there are other factors that uh, you have, uh, you can manage better your free time. 
you have few months contract, few months at sea, few months on land. You can, uh, in your holidays, you can do whatever you want to do. Do your uh, hobby or spend more time with your with the people you love. And also the other plus, big plus, is that you can live wherever you want. Uh, for doing this job, you don't have to live in your country or in any country. We are in our DP training center. Uh, this place is configured as the example of a DP bridge. And uh, as you able to see, uh, people which are gathered here, they are trying to uh, create the scenario and operate the scenario of a DP vessel. Uh, basically, this facility is uh, prepared for the training of future DP operators. And we've got all the equipment which is necessary to create as much as possible realistic scenarios for uh, any basically DP offshore um, operation. Uh, simulators are able to simulate the equipment for DP class 2 vessels and uh, we are able to create the scenarios for different vessels models starting from the multi-purpose DP vessel, shuttle tankers, uh, semi-submersible rigs, drilling vessels. Um, we are mostly occupied with training which is accredited by Nautical Institute. Um, there are two types of uh, basic of, of, of this training courses. First is basic course which uh, is basically first introduction to the DP equipment. At the moment we are in, pro in progress of a DP advanced course, uh, which is more sophisticated, more comprehensive course, uh, which uh, is actually the next step of DP training. And uh, all this can uh, bring uh, this young gentleman, our students, to the, um, give them a chance to obtain the DP operator certificate and in future work on uh, dynamically positioning vessels as a dynamic positioning officers and operators. When I was young, I used to go to the vessel with my uncle. He's a, a marine navigator. It was very beautiful, so I got a scholarship from my the government. So I came to Poland because they have one of the best marine navigation schools. That's why I'm here to study navigation. My name is Bobby Uduma. I am from Nigeria, Port Harcourt. The reason why I study marine is because, number one, marine is a lucrative job. And secondly, I love anything maritime and why I came to Poland is because they have good teachers, more better education and the reason why I want to be a seafarer is because the seafaring job is good. I'm Salo Oyeng's Eto, a Nigerian. The marine field is something I dread so much right from my teenage and uh, I have this dream of becoming a sailor. Hello, my name is my name is Adam Kalivinu Minaka. I'm from Nigeria. I, I believe Poland has the best facilities for us to become a navigator. We are very grateful that the, the teachers and the lecturers are, are taking good care of us and they are teaching us very well. So I, I believe that after graduating from um, this maritime university here in Poland, we are going to do be more better uh, 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 navigators in future. Hello, my name is Maria Łozińska and I am a teacher of English at Gdynia Maritime University at the Faculty of Navigation. I have been teaching future seafarers and deck officers for more than 30 years. My students who graduate from university and complete Gdynia Maritime College, they come back to school after a couple of years in order to do some specialized courses necessary in their profession. Whenever I meet them, I ask them some questions regarding their 
work, careers, with families and plans for the future. Generally, what they say is that work at sea is very demanding, requiring a lot of skills, knowledge, abilities, but at the same time they claim and admit that this job gives them a lot of satisfaction. It teaches them how to cope with different problems, even those most difficult ones, how to work, live and cooperate with people of various cultural backgrounds. But for some of them it also is uh, the fact that this profession offers quite good money. Uh, this job seems to be more and more popular and attractive, not only for young people who just start their professional career, but quite surprisingly, it's also very popular among people who are educated from different universities and colleges and who used to be employed in different sectors of industry and administration, and now they are looking for fresh challenge. They want to work at sea. Hi, my name is Silvia and I come from Spain. Um, I'm here in Virginia doing an Erasmus student for, uh, for being a seafarer, like an officer in a ship. And I decided to do this uh, career because uh, since I was born, I've been near the sea and I feel some kind of attraction with the sea life. And and um, that's all. I, I don't have any other reason. When I started to do the career, I discovered that I really like it and I decided to finish. My name is Pablo, I'm from Spain and I'm here to, to learn more and to learn English. And I want to be a seaman because I want to know the world and see around the world. And I don't know more, but I like sea and I like sailing and another sport water. I'm Norbert, I'm from Spain and I'm studying maritime navigation. It was my dream for, uh, from when I was a child. And, but I like the, the sea uh, atmosphere and I also think uh, it's a good job. Problems with work exist not only in Poland. These problems we observe in other countries too. So therefore we know that in England or in Germany, for example, being seafarer is more and more popular. When I was speaking with Kuba Szymański from Intermanager from England, he confirmed what I'm telling you. And all we know that the sea transport is the best form of transport. Why? because it is the cheapest and because this transport doesn't destroy the environment or if you like, this transport is more friendly for environment. That is why we support this, tra this transport, this job, and that is why we support and accept and assist activities of, of ship owners. I would like to add that seafarers care about other people. They understand that somebody may need help, support and assistance. Mr. Marek Szymański from Warsaw, also known as Gargamel, publishes a daily newspaper for seafarers called Dzień Dobry to Polska. He sent this newspaper to seafarers by email. The newspaper is free of charge, however Gargamel appeals to the readers and kindly asks for a donation to be paid to liver in order to help children with liver disorders. The seafarers that support this action are not only from Poland, but from all over the world. We are very grateful to their attitude and we uh, would like to express our gratitude to Mr. Marek Szymański.